Pneumatic Real Actuator Design, Modeling, and Implementation. We present a pneumatic actuator that is highly extensible, lightweight, compliant, inexpensive, and capable of operating in compression and tension. We've constructed pneumatic real actuators with extension ratios greater than 16 to 1 and force to weight ratios over 28 to 1. The pneumatic real actuator is comprised of a thin lay flat tubing containing a plastic insert that is wound about a retractable spring loaded mechanism. The primary components of this mechanism include the reel, which spools the tubing, and the back plate, which guides the tubing on and off the reel. Underneath each cap of the reel, we find a spiral torsion spring, a ball bearing, and the arbor. The arbor, which is mechanically coupled to the back plate, transfers the motion of the back plate with respect to the reel to the torsion springs. As air enters the tubing from the end opposite of the mechanism, the flexible but mostly inextensible membrane of the tubing forms into a cylindrical beam with significantly increased stiffness. As the volume of air inside the actuator rises, more of the tubing is pulled out of the reel to form the beam, lengthening the actuator and storing energy in the torsion springs. As the volume of air decreases, the springs wind the slack tubing back onto the reel and the actuator shortens. We have constructed two applications utilizing multiple pneumatic reel actuators. The first application is a 3 degree of freedom parallel robotic arm, similar to a delta mechanism. By manipulating the lengths of each actuator individually, it is possible to translate the arm in three dimensions. This robotic arm is lightweight, inexpensive, and safe for interactions with humans. The pneumatic reel actuator was also used to construct a self-deformable robot with a fixed actuator topology. Six actuators are joined together at nodes constructed of flexible silicon to form a tetrahedron. Pressure lines are connected to the three nodes at the base of the tetrahedron. This initial prototype weighs just 2.2 newtons, has a side extension ratio of 5.4 to 1, and a volumetric ratio of 160 to 1. Future work on the pneumatic reel actuator will be directed towards the integration into larger scale self-deformable robotic systems. One application is a soft and interactive volumetric shape display. We have simulated a network of 120 actuators forming into three distinct shapes. Finally, these networks can also be used to form modular robots capable of locomotion. The high extension ratio provided by the pneumatic reel actuator potentially enables new locomotion modalities. For example, one intriguing mode of locomotion we imagine is one in which the robot turns itself inside out.